Video has been released of a San Diego Sheriff's deputy shooting and killing an unarmed man as he ran away from the downtown jail. As News 8's David Godfordson reports, the deputy has since resigned and is now facing a charge of second degree murder. Is that how he appeared on May 1st, 2020? Yes, it was. Deputy Aaron Russell was in full uniform, arriving on foot to work at the downtown jail, when right in front of him, a man escaped from the back seat of a State Park Rangers patrol car. 36-year-old Nicholas Bills had slipped one hand out of his handcuffs. He slams a door on another ranger and runs away from the jail. Deputy Aaron Russell pulls his pistol and shoots, hitting Bills at least four times, killing him. Mr. Russell removed his handgun from his sight holster, uh, pointed his firearm at Mr. Bills as he ran uh, northbound. Russell resigned in the wake of the shooting. Now he's charged with second degree murder. Video of the shooting was played publicly for the first time Monday during a preliminary hearing. Attorneys for the former deputy made it clear they intend to argue the shooting was justified. Look at the top of the video. You can see a pair of red shoes belonging to a nurse who was standing nearby on the sidewalk. And as you see that, does that uh, refresh your recollection on what that is? Yes, I believe it was a person walking by. I don't recall the name. During cross-examination of a San Diego police sergeant, the defense team implied that nurse could have been in danger and the handcuff still on Bill's wrist might have been mistaken for a weapon. Were you able to determine in the course of your investigation whether or not the cuff that Mr. Bills had removed from his left wrist was hanging down loose or whether he had gripped it in his hand to keep it from dangling? I, I, I did not, I don't know. I didn't know how he was holding it. I, I, did, I didn't come to that conclusion. Testimony in the preliminary hearing will continue tomorrow. When it's all over, the judge has to decide whether there's enough evidence for the case to go to trial. Carlo? Disturbing video, David. What other evidence will be presented tomorrow? Well, we're hearing there are three more surveillance cameras, but it's unclear when those videos would be shown in court. Uh, we will hear from the two park rangers who are transporting bills to the jail when the escape ha when the escape happened? All right, we look forward to seeing and hearing more evidence in this case. David Goffertson reporting live. Thank you, David.